hello friends and my dear students as we are coming to the series of product development launching subject in which we are going to study what do you understand and how you will configure the product architecture like product architecture and in this series we will study these topics introduction of architecture what is the product architecture and the types of product architecture which are which is our major concern and product modularity there are various kind of modularity which you have to study and where they are going to be used and what are the modular designs like basic cluster me clustering method advanced functional method based development team and at the last i will conclude the session so in this session we will try to cover as much as possible <coughs> so basically what is in we are touching in architecture so soon we come familiar with this word architecture like you will see this is a beach based uh, architecture home so the architecture of this is looks like this not like this this is a constructed view of any architecture model okay and similarly in the con contemporary kind of houses like this this is the architecture so this is a perfect definition of architecture whenever you are designing or any simulating the model in the paper or in the software so this is a kind of architecture okay so and basically if you will define it into the words this is embodiment of concept and the allocation of physical information to the element of forms and definition of structural interface among the objects basically it consists of three words which is function form and concept so in if you will include these three terms then that is called as product architecture okay or architecture now <coughs> now we will see what is function function provide for meeting a place visual main speaker procession and concept is church okay so these are three things which will come under the function as per this example okay and function provided for meeting place visual large cast if it is concept is amphitheater okay so these are the things which is used for the and this is the form it will look like this now function is provide for meeting place and each participant visible to other if if this is the term means the concept is of meeting room so this is your form your forms will be like this okay so this is a function concept form okay so this is your function concept and form for the first example this is your function concept and form for the second one and this is these are the functions and this is the concept and this is for your form okay so and function often follows the form often follows the function okay means if you are ready with the functions then only you will generate the form or design okay now what do you understand by the product architecture and its type that we will see so basically product architecture if you will go to the product development book or design engineering book of I Alrich and Uppinger, then you will find out a definition of the scheme by which function of product is allocated to physical component that is called as a scheme that is called as product architecture. Similarly, or more oftenly product architecture is also called as arrangement of functional elements, whatever functional elements are there, you will see there is a structural diagram of your motherboard. So that you have already means you have often seen during your desk, desktop computer okay so there you will find out there are some places for the hard disk there are some places for the ram so that is called as arrangement of functional elements or mapping of functional element to the physical element that is called as product architecture now architecture is structure how it will look like or how you can create it create a schematic of product okay then cluster the element of schematic means reflect geometric integration or functional function sharing means you have to cluster the elements according to their sharings okay according to their similar pro characteristics or vendor expertise current consideration or localization of changes depends on your designing or depends on your architectural structure okay then create a rough geometric layout after that identify the fundamental and incidental interaction between the clusters okay clusters whatever clusters you have designed you have to identify what is the fundamental and incidental interaction means whatever well, the relationship between one cluster to the other then define the secondary subsystems okay at the last you have to if you are ready with the secondary subsystem then at the last you can club all those things this is the example of coffee maker overall function of this coffee maker is brew the coffee okay and supporting sub function what are the sub functions are there in this system so sub are 
like it used to store the water means water will supply water supply of water will be here and this is the whole water cycle okay and heat the water for heating the water electricity will be needed then heat the coffee again electricity will be needed next ground coffee will be there at the outside then you have to store the grounds in one container then mix coffee and water means heated water will come he from here and the grounded coffee will come from this way and you have to mix the coffee and water in this container or in this portion then heated coffee will come from here then store the coffee here and you have to serve the coffee from here shut off the heater if it is already stored grind the beans coffee beans will be here from here you have to grind the beans from here and supply it to there so this is your auxiliary function auxiliary function means this is not your supporting sub functions this is the sub subordinate functions of your coffee maker so you have to keep this thing in mind whenever you are designing so this is one example i have taken in the next lecture we will start with the architectural type which is integral product architecture and modular what are the differences between these two that we will see so i am winding up my session here stay tuned with engineering college banswada youtube channel for more such content thank you so much for your patience listening thank you